<laughs> now you told me this hour I have done weeping. All the kind of the nonsense that is very faulty. I have received my proportion like the British son, and I'm going with Sir Proteus to the Imperial's court. I think <laughs> Crab, my dog, be the sourest natured dog that lives. My mother weeping, my father wailing, my sister crying, our maid howling, our cat wringing her hands, and all our house in a great perplexity. Yet did not this cruel hearted cur shed one tear? Hmm? He is a stone, a very pitiful stone, and has no more pity in him than a dog. A Jew would have wept to have seen our parting. Why, my granddam, having no eyes, look, you wept herself blind at my parting. Nay, I'll show you the manner of it. This shoe is my father. No, this left shoe is my father. No, no, this left shoe is my mother. Nay, that cannot be so neither. Yes, it is so, it is so. It hath the worser soul. This shoe with a hole in it is my mother, and this my father. A vengeance aunt! There it is. Now, sir, this staff is my sister. For look you, she is as white as a lily and as small as a wand. This hat is Nan our maid. I am the dog. No, the dog is himself, and I am the dog. Oh, the dog is me. Hmm, and I am myself. I so, so, now come out to my father. Father, your blessing. Now should not the shoe speak a word for weeping? Hmm? Now should I kiss my father? Well, he weeps on. Now come out to my mother. Oh, that she could speak now like a wood woman. Well, I kiss her. Why, there it is. Here's my mother's breath going up and down. Now, sir, come out to my sister. Mark the moan she makes. Now the dog, all this while, sheds not one tear nor speaks a word. But see how I lay the dust with my tears.